Hey, what's up, folks? This is a useful video. No utility whatsoever. You should stop watching, but I'm so excited. Uh, I replaced my CPU and motherboard because my other CPU and motherboard uh, exploded through various fault of mine and it. What happened was, is it, it was a Skylake i3 dual core, four thread, you know, low end Skylake. And it just, my system got super slow and it turns out the Skylake was just permanently throttled down to 0.8 megahertz, gigahertz, megahertz, whatever the hertz is, slow. And I did a BIOS update and it was just the CPU is bad. So I thought, I'll, I'll see if I can reseat the CPU and maybe that'll fix something. So I pull it out and I forget Skylake CPUs are pinless. So look at the bottom, it's like, holy crap, all the pins have been ripped out into the socket. So then I put my finger on the socket and of course bend all the pins there that are supposed to be there and not on the chip. So there I ruined the motherboard as well. So I pretty much need a new system. So I got an MSI motherboard. It's like a Caitlin, Catlin, Karachi, I don't know. But it's like a nice gaming motherboard with pretty and some lights on it. It's yeah, I don't need that much motherboard, but I've learned the super cheap motherboards are no fun. So I got that and I got uh, went away from Intel and got an AMD Ryzen 5 1600. That's one of the new Ryzen series and it is, you'll see from HTOP over here, it's got six cores, 12 threads. Six cores, 12 threads. It's a six core CPU. It's got a 16 megabyte cache. A max turbo frequency is 3.6 gigahertz, whatever. It even comes with a really nice cooler. Intel chips come with, it's basically a piece of tin foil with an angry bee attached to it. This is like a really nice copper base, uh, big fan, big heat sink cooler. This is very nice. And that processor was like a little over 200 bucks, like 205 bucks for a six core processor that would basically take every, I don't want to even speculate how much cost the server at work and just thrash it on its head. So CPU motherboard, like 300 bucks. And all I've really done with it is run Chrome and it is really, really fast, but it was pretty fast before. I'll try some benchmarks later. I'll, I'll try running a, uh, what can I run? I could do some video encoding, but it'd just be fake stuff. Maybe the best thing is doing the, uh, the open map tiles, generating tiles, and I'll see if it makes a difference. Cause I think that was CPU band on my system. Anyway, this is a useless video. I'm just so excited because I've got like, I'm going to, I'm going to have to make my window bigger when I run HTOP because it's got 12 freaking threads taking up my whole screen. Anyway, the Ryzen CPU is so far, I, I haven't done anything with it. Maybe there's no smoke coming out. So I'm giving it a thumbs up and it was compared to Intel, their prices right now. It's a really good deal. Anyway, Catch you later. Bye-bye. I said bye-bye. <laughs> Would you stop recording? Oh, wait. I ain't got it now. And...